Of all the techniques involved in making a good drink, measuring your ingredients comes first and is the most important step. I've tried several different styles of jiggering over the years, but I've settled on a particular technique that I want to share with you today. The type of jigger you decide to use is a matter of preference, and there are pros and cons to every type out there. But the biggest benefit of this technique is the ability to confidently measure to meniscus instead of measuring against a graduated line, which at times can be difficult to see. Aside from that, the biggest reason that I've used this technique for so long is because it's just so much more dynamic and fun than any other style that I've come across. To start, you'll need two double-sided standard jiggers, one measuring half and three quarters ounce, and another measuring one and two ounces. So let's take a look at the small jigger first. The grip here is really simple. You'll just pick it up using your thumb and index finger. I'll often use my middle finger as well to help stabilize. The crux of this entire technique is really just how to rotate the small jigger to access the alternate measurement. We can do this by simply placing the middle finger behind and pushing out from the bottom, while pinching and pulling back using the thumb and index finger. Once the rotation is complete, we should end up with our middle finger in place of the index. So just switch back to the index finger to reset the grip. Now that we have a grasp on that, let's learn how to hold the one and two ounce jigger. So for this one, we'll slide it in between our middle and ring finger and keep it just in front of the second knuckle. The alternate position can be achieved by twisting the middle and ring fingers and using the index to catch and support. Now it's time to combine all this into one technique. There's just a couple new pieces of information here. One is to make sure that the pinky is being used for support and to keep everything nice and tight. Now, when it comes to actually pouring, it's important to know that your half and three quarter ounce measurements will be poured by tilting them inwards to the side, while the one and two ounce measurements will be more of an overhand forward tilt away from you. So, one of my favorite aspects of this technique is that this particular grip allows you to pick up and set your tools down in one motion. So first of all, realize that our resting position has the one ounce at the base and the two ounce acting as a cradle that will hold the smallest measure securely. You can pick these up in one motion by using your index and thumb here and your middle and ring fingers here. Putting them down is even easier. Simply collapse the half ounce into the two ounce cradle. Set it all down on the one ounce side. That's pretty much it guys. This isn't the simplest approach to jiggering, but if you're someone who wants to expand on your skill set, I strongly recommend practicing this technique. It'll take an otherwise repetitive aspect of what you do every night. It is something a lot more dynamic and fun.